This video demonstration will show you how to use the Wi-Fi Video Grabber software in conjunction with All Sports Systems Motion View Video Analysis software to accomplish very effective recording and transfer of files wirelessly from the camera. The Wi-Fi Video Grabber is integrated into Motion View, although you do license it separately. Having been presented with the Wi-Fi Video Grabber screen, simply select your device, we'll use the GoPro Hero in this example, and press Connect. Now on my desktop, just to show you, there is a GoPro Hero camera sitting here. It is wirelessly connected to my computer and is currently being monitored by the Wi-Fi Video Grabber software. I also have now on my desktop a live preview screen showing the video feed coming out of the GoPro camera and as I move the camera around you can see the live preview also moves. We may or may not make use of that during the entire session so you can close it if you don't want to see that and you can also minimize the screen of the Wi-Fi video grabber by pressing the information button on the far left. Now we have a nice small button or uh, form that we can place anywhere on our screen and it will stay in the foreground even while we work with our motion view software here. Let's go ahead and record a short clip from the camera. I'll do that by pressing the record button on the software and then I've just pressed the button a second time to end the recording. Now in just a moment we should see the video files uh, video file be downloaded into our computer and I want you to notice that the active project folder inside Motion View is the captured videos folder. Well, the Wi-Fi Video Grabber software is aware of this fact, and so it will automatically place new files in the current active project folder. So now if I bring this new file that came in up into my workspace in Motion View, there you can see the live video feed that was captured from the camera itself. Now if we change the active project folder in our motion view, let's say that we bring it down to a new folder here called imported, oh, we'll take one just called Wi-Fi. I will set that as the active project folder. If I display the information in the Wi-Fi video grabber, you'll notice that it has already been notified of the change. So any new files that we record now will come in to this folder. This is very handy so I don't have to interact with the software, the grabber software, beyond just pressing the record button. Now I'm also going to demonstrate that you can capture video by using the record button on the camera. So just to show you the live indication of what I'm about to do, I'm going to press the camera's record button this time, which I've just done. I'll just wave in front of it a little bit here. And now finish that recording. And you'll see that the Wi-Fi video grabber will automatically detect the new file and bring it down to my computer just as if I had used the record button here on the software. So either way that you want to do it, you can record from the camera or you can record from the software. It will automatically bring the clips down for you and place them in the correct folder that you're currently working with inside Motion View. Very handy for getting these videos into your video analysis software where you can then do further analysis on them. Now one point to take note of is that the Wi-Fi Video Grabber software will only bring in new video clips that are captured after you have connected to the camera. This is intentional so that we don't inadvertently wind up spending an hour or so downloading hundreds of clips that you may have previously captured. So think of it like a live feed camera. It records when you press the button and those are the videos you get here in the software. That is the Wi-Fi Video Grabber from All Sports Systems. Thank you for watching.